I hope all of you is having a productive damn day. In the game, yeah. So you best know my name, yeah. Fuck out of money and fame, yeah. I'ma keep doing my thing, yeah. I'll be the best in the game, yeah. Everybody knows my name, yeah. Fuck out of money and fame, yeah. That shit is so overplayed. Yeah. Well, guys, man, I'm back again with another video. Uh, this video right here, the Saints have signed another uh, asset to the team, Chris Herndon. Uh, he's a tight end. Form, uh, he was a former Jet. He was the Jet. Um, he was like the Jet, kind of like um, that year, 2018-19, whatever. Uh, 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 doing his rookie season and and so and so. Uh, Sir Sam Donner, whatever his name is, the guy number 14 they had, that was his primary target. Chris Harden, Harden, whatever. That was his favorite target. Trust me, as the guy go on, if he make plays for us, I'm going to start remembering the guy's name. <laughs> but uh, it seemed that he was the uh, main target that, that uh, Sam Donner had back with the Jets. Uh, he also signed... Uh, to the Minnesota Vikings a year before this. He did not have a promising year. It was a disappointment year. So he was a free agent. Now the Saints is willing to get his guy a shot. I'm not sure if he's going to make the team or be that one or two because as you know, we got Troutman. Uh, we got Taysom Hill. And then we also got another guy. Uh, uh, we got... Uh, uh, Dewan Johnson, uh, we got him as well. You know, like, we got some pieces, man. So, I don't know where he will fit on the team. Uh, it's an okay pickup for a depth. But um, we just had to just see, man. Like, we just had to just see uh, what the future may hold for this guy, you know. But it's just me reporting that uh, we got us another tight end. Uh, let's just see, can he put in that work, you know what I'm saying? Because at the end of the day, it is what it is. A few years back, he was a good receiver. He uh, he he was also good for uh, uh, yards after the catch, so he could keep the chain moving and get more. So that's what he was known for, for from his rookie on up until he got with Minnesota, had a sluggish year. So um, we just got to see what you know what he could bring to the table. Anyway, you you guys can share your thoughts down below. Um, Man, listen, comment, okay? Y'all, just comment your thoughts, man, all right? Just comment your thoughts, or or you can also uh, comment down below of a few topics that you probably want me to react to, and then, you know, as you know, your boy got some crazy-ass reactions, so I don't mind doing that as well, all right? So, uh, anyway, I hope all of you is having a productive day, a blessed day. And uh, until next time, who that? Yo, quick, 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 quick. Yo, quick video, quick video. Um, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going... Hold on. Let me see. Oh. All right. All right. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to make another video on the on the Tyron Matthew situation. It reported by Adam Troutman, whatever this guy's name is. He said that... The Saints front office is um, is it, it just pretty much being patient with Tyron Matthews to deal with whatever he needs to deal with, and then uh, say that they're gonna be very patient with him. All right, so that was reported as well. I just wanted to add this on this video, and um, I'm trying to see what else here. Yeah, and, and, and um, you know, Avicamara court date is pretty much. I think is either today or tomorrow or sometime this week. So be prepared for that, whatever happens with that. And, um, yeah, that just the other updates that I got for you guys. Until then, who that?